Taking a look at the interest rate market today, I want to focus on the 10-year note today. We did see a big rally across all the different durations, and the back end of the curve actually was the stronger performer today when you look at the strength. Uh, I think 30-year yields went to the lowest level in about a little of three weeks. Uh, but when you look at the 10-year, a uh, significant move as well. We saw quite a spike with the equity market selling off. Uh, this kind of risk-off uh, mentality now it appears to be back into the market, at least short term. Uh, due to some of the data points that came out today, and I'll get to that in a moment. But when you look at the price structure of the 10-year note, right around the 130, 11 half level. So again, the high end of the range here for the last few weeks. And looking at the forces behind this, I think basically you have to look at the narrative coming out of the China-U.S. trade situation. Now, there was an indi indication yesterday that the meeting in Chile is probably not going to be uh, basically canceled. Uh, so it does not look like there's anything that's going to get done there. The in expectations in the marketplace were such that uh, there might be a preliminary deal between China and U.S. that would be signed down there in the coming weeks, but that appears to be off the table. And then overnight, uh, the China administration put a scare into the market here on this Halloween Thursday when they basically indicated that they don't really see any way to get something meaningful in place in the current structure. And that definitely impacted the markets today when we saw the equity market sell off and we saw that bond market bid come firmly back into the markets today. Looking at um, some of the dynamics also in the marketplace, I want to point out that when you look at uh, the trends in place right now, we're looking at yields pushing back down to the middle of the range really for October. Now we did see yields at the high end of the range just a couple weeks ago, but now with this most recent uh, news breaking, we're seeing yields pushing back down and we saw 11 basis point move today. So we saw yields actually start today right around the one spot 796 level down to the one spot 682 level uh, intraday. So again, a big move in yields today, pushing yields back down to the middle of their range, which comes in around one spot 51 to the one spot 90 level. So uh, once again, we're seeing volatility coming back into the market, at least for today, with this big risk off mentality entering the market, bond prices higher, equity prices lower.